This is Twit. But uh, hey, I got so uh, this I have uh, the new the three hundred twenty nine dollar uh, iPad that was announced at Apple's uh, event. This is Apple's loaner. This is not mine. But I'm actually kind of thinking about buying one for myself uh, because the last part of my testing was uh, last week when I went on. I was in New York City for uh, five days uh, for some business and some pleasure, and I decided, okay, great. I'm going to leave behind the MacBook. I'm even going to leave behind my. Uh, 12.9 inch uh, iMac Pro, uh, excuse me, uh, of course, my uh, 12.9 inch iPad Pro and just rely on the $329 iPad uh, paired with a Bluetooth keyboard of my own uh, my own ab abstraction, but uh, still just that in the Apple Pencil. And I got to admit, it, it, it did the job. It's like I, I wrote about three or four thousand words. I took about two or three thousand pictures. Some of those pictures I uh, felt like I wanted to edit them in Lightroom Mobile and then post them or do something else that was cool with them. I was managing my inbox. I was managing calendars. I was doing a whole bunch of stuff for business that's going to be happening in the next three or four weeks. Uh, I have to say that I, I did miss having the larger screen real, real estate of my iPad Pro. I was missing how easy it was to have like a work pane mm -hmm. and then on the other third, just a just a, a Twitter pane or just a picture in picture. Mm -hmm. uh, it's not as though the, the this iPad can't do stuff like that, but it becomes a lot more, you know, a lot more Lilliputian when you're uh, squeezing things down to that. Uh, and so. I uh, it's it's not as though I felt as though I'm on the uh, I'm on the countdown to buy a brand new iPad Pro this year or next year uh, because I, I did buy the very first uh, model that came out I ordered it the same day it was announced uh, but I was sort of thinking that if the, that uh, the next uh, the, when the next model that comes out with a good uh, an interesting new feature set uh, would certainly be uh, liable for <laughs> for another thousand dollar purchase now i'm like uh, it's kind of nice the the size was um the, the only thing that was I, I'm, I'm i'm a little bit torn on whether the size was a positive or negative thing because uh, it's certainly smaller uh, my other ipad is uh, an ipad mini which unfortunately is now so old that it really feels really slow when i'm using it uh and this is Nothing, no, no speed glitches whatsoever. Even when I was doing video, even when I was doing photos, uh, and it's small enough that I can one hand it very easily while still being big enough to uh, read comic books and stuff like that on. And unfortunately, it's just a little bit too big for uh, I, my my usual. I have one bag that I designate as the bag I take when I don't want to take something as big as a laptop bag. This is just it. It's small enough that I can fit in there so long as I don't also have like a camera lens and a charger and other things. It's uh, it's OK for a few hours out, but maybe not OK for for a trip. But I'm, I was surprised that uh, even just simply as a solution to a future problem of when I need to get a new iPad, I might even I might not even want to get the uh, the, the 10 inch uh, iPad Pro. I might want to get this because it does the job and it's I can and I can for the for the money that I would have budgeted, I can certainly afford to max out the RAM uh, and uh, it would just still do everything for me. So uh, we, we have we ha everybody who's in this conversation does way more traveling than they wish. Then as a kid, they'd be shocked that we're, are you complaining that you get to travel so much? Yes, mm -hmm. son, we're, we're adults. We the fact that we were home for three days, we have to eat all of the perishable stuff in the fridge because we're going to be leaving for another two weeks after that. That gets old after a while.